guys Michael from Mario Unboxing so in today's video I'm going to be doing an unboxing of the all new Samsung Galaxy A01 this device and also in this video I'm going to be giving you my first impressions of this device what's up guys Michael from Mario Unboxing we're happy to make decision in buying budget smartphones and gadgets like this if you are new here kindly hit on the subscribe button below and turn on post notification to support my channel so inside the box we have the phone itself with some highlights of the specs up front Warranty card, user manual, micro USB cable, 5 watt power brick, standard Samsung headphones, and a safe injector to which I forgot at the store. My bad. And that's all for what we have inside the box. The Samsung Galaxy A1 is the most affordable device in the Samsung Galaxy A series lineup and it is priced at $92 or 33,000 Naira. The entry level smartphone features a sleek design and an infinity display with down to 8 specs. This device packs a 5.7 inch TFT HD Plus Infinity V display with a 79.1 screen to body ratio housed in a plastic body with a matte finish which doesn't feel cheap. It is offered in 3 colors which are blue, black and red and my variant is the blue variant. Under the hood, the Samsung Galaxy A01 is powered by a Qualcomm Snapdragon 439 processor coupled with a 2 gigs of RAM and 16 gigs of storage which is very low in 2020. I have most of my apps and files moved from my previous device and I can tell you that I only have 800 LB left of storage and with that you can expand the storage with a micro SD card up to 512 GB. Keeping this device juiced up is a 3000 mAh battery which can be charged through a micro USB with a 5 watt power brick which is inside the box. Note that this device doesn't support fast charging in any way. The dual SIM device also boasts of a triple colored slot and also features a 3.5mm headphone jack. This phone uses face unlock for authentication which is really not that secure but is better than nothing. Also note that there is no fingerprint on this device. While it offers a single fire speaker at the back, it also supports Dolby Atmos. In the camera department, the phone comes with a 13 megapixel f2.2 main camera paired with a 2 megapixel f2.4 depth sensor at the back. On the front is a 5 megapixel f2.2 selfie shooter, which is housed in the Infinity V display. Here are some pictures and videos taken on the Samsung Galaxy A01. So this is a video of the red facing camera. I don't know what they think about it in the camera special video. The Samsung Galaxy A1 runs on Android 10 out of the box with one UI 2.0 from Samsung. On the left we have the volume rockers, on the right we have the cartridge which has its dual 4G nano SIMs and an SD card and also on the right we have the power button. At the top we have the 3.5mm headphone jack, at the bottom we have the mic and the micro USB port, at the back we have the dual camera setup with a flash, Samsung branding and backward firing speaker. For $92 or 33,000 Naira, you can get this phone for your kids around the age of 13 to 15 which are always disturbing you for a device or for the people from the 80s. Yeah. My only problem with this device is that it has a small screen and a small battery. Also, there's no fingerprint, which is not a deal breaker for me, but it's a deal breaker for some other people. And also, there's no Type C port and no fast charging, unlike the Redmi 8A. Let me know in the comment section below of what you think about the Samsung Galaxy A01. Don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and share. And I'll see you on my next video. Peace.